2009 we already have this um, experience on the same topic when we shot another documentary called uh, Angeles City Philippines and uh, already in that occasion we had the opportunity to see many uh, footage that were uh, uploaded on the internet by many sex tourists and um, one of them was the protagonist of the movie we are showing uh, this year and um, he started in 2006 uploading uh, videos on the internet about his adventures in, the, in these places where uh, sex tourism takes place and um, we've been uh, watching some uh, few hundred videos of his and uh, we came up with the idea of editing some of them ourselves in order to kind of make a portrait of him that would go beyond what he could uh, manage to represent by himself. We obviously were aware of the fact that um, if you put an image in a different context you change its meaning and therefore our uh, editing has um, tried to really, as I said, just to make a kind of an intimate portrait of the protagonist that uh, would have been impossible in the um, if we try to shoot this in a conventional way, so we shooting him, but that um, is possible if it is him uh, trying to film what he thinks is his own uh, experience. And then with our editing, we just try to kind of um, help his uh, personality to come out. And um, we, we spent so many months just watching this footage that uh, actually at the end we kind of got uh, affectionate maybe of this person and uh, I must say we don't think he's uh, an absolute uh, evil person. We tried to, to really understand him through the representations of himself that he, that he was giving and that was the, that was the idea of the, of the whole movie. We think it's um, it's a very contemporary thing to do, to work with uh, found footage that is uh, uploaded online. And, uh, and therefore we thought, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it would make sense to, to just work with, you, with YouTube videos. <laughs> yeah, yeah, one more, more to play. Hop. It would be very interesting to even collaborate with him in the future, maybe, to make this uh, portrait more complete. Mm -hmm. Because, of course, it would be very interesting to see what he thinks about our editing. Mm -hmm. But uh, for this particular approach, this particular video, I think that um, since we worked only on his own representations, yeah. this is what, for us, it's him. And I think whenever you see any film, the, the point of view of um, the director, or in our case, the director as an editor, is, um, is present in every single choice he made. So we didn't want this to become too obvious. So it kind of plays as, um, I give you this video as putting yourself as an audience in the shoes of the person shooting, but of course we added meaning with our cuts and uh, it's our own editing of his videos. Okay, so this uh, documentary we are presenting is 25 minutes and now we are actually thinking about um, making this uh, a long feature documentary with um, not only YouTube videos but different approach, so with something shot also by us. It's really a pity that most of these videos uh, have a soundtrack because you lose the audio, which is very important, we think. And so we, amongst uh, maybe more than four or five hundred videos we've been watching, we could only use a few. That's why it would make sense to contact him and actually getting this footage. Because then we would have a lot more material to work with. It's interesting to see the reaction that YouTube users uh, have to his videos because, first of all, he has more than 6 million uh, viewers on his videos, which is a dream for any documentary filmmaker. And um, second, uh, he kind of uh, managed to create an online platform, an online community where uh, international sex tourists can exchange information 
very specific information uh, sometimes. And uh, this really gives you an idea about what you can do with the internet. People interested in this topic are his colleagues, let's say, and they really exchange information as if it was uh, you suggesting me a good restaurant where you've been eating and uh, go there because the meat is fantastic. You know.